Hi everyone. So in this video, I'm probably going to be eaten alive by mosquitoes a while. Also, I'm going to check out the HS14422, uh, which is a brushless truggy. And HS now has some parts that look kind of like uh, MJX. Let's find out whether it's the same quality. Would be great. So have fun. And here it is. Brushless power from Hostbeat. And this box is covered with some stuff that makes it like shiny and stuff. And one of the selling points is the battery is in a hard case, but it has a waterproof <laughs> blushless <laughs> ESC. And also blushless is the motor. And here's the so-called modular battery. It's not really modular because I cannot use it so much with others. So yeah, they have different models. I actually wanted to have the 14431, but here I am with the 422. At least they are consistent with their mistake. And here it's still blushless instead of brushless and lots of metal parts. But I think worries me a little bit is that they said that they have shocks, but they did not mention oil shocks. So let's have a look. Oh, here you can see the insides or metal gearing. Let's open it up. And we have an instruction manual. Let's let's read it. Ooh, nice colors, but we will have a look at it later. So here we have the battery and the charger is also inside. Uh, yeah, and we have a little screwdriver as well and a wrenching tool already attached is the wheelie bar Wee! and moment of truth Yeah, no plastic straps and the remote So we have the on button of course we have steering trim steering duro rate and the speed which is turned up to 100% of already and we have this foam grip and it's kind of good for one-handed steering yeah fully proportional as well and yeah oh yeah let's put this down here <laughs> yeah perfect all good now and yeah as i said one-handed steering feels good and fully proportional Th uh, throttle and steering is here's where the batteries go the batteries are not included let's bounce those aren't oil shocks But something cool that we have is this flippy floppy color. It changes between purple and some greenish bluish color. It's kind of cool. And here we have the metal shocks. Yes. The tires are okay. A bit grippy. I like that you cannot lose your clips so easily. That's a cool idea. So let's have a look inside. Uh, whoops, almost nicked the cable there, so be careful. And here we have the motor with heatsink. It's a 4000 kV brushless motor, which apparently gets hot. Here we have the three wire servo, ESC combo with heatsink, and there's a DEANS connector for your battery. It comes with a 2S and it has this hatch to open and inside we have this honeycomb which I've seen at the MJX models. Let's have a look at the shocks again. I'm a bit disappointed. Yeah, they are metal and they look cool, but why aren't they oil filled? I mean, it's the brushless version. It should have them. Yeah, and they're adjustable and I will have to probably adjust it. They're quite bouncy. Also not MJX is this cheap plastic. If it were MJX, it would be adjustable and metal. And the plastic that they use overall is very scratchy and sounds kind of cheap. 
we do get metal dog bones in the front and in the back which is a good thing and on the bottom yeah the plastic of this actually seems all right it seems sturdy but now let's have a look at the performance power on car on all right let's go hmm did i feel some delay there and here as well there's always a little bit of delay in the beginning but look at the colors though all right let's run the music and have some fun One cool thing about this one, it will actually take 3S batteries and here is one from Zop Power. Let's plug it in and let's go. I mean, if I get it to fit somehow. <laughs> Looking good, right? Uh, well, kind of. Yeah, okay. Let's just leave it like that. Power on. Car on. Let's go. Well, the speed is great on 3S, but having no oil shocks is a big letdown, so that's the first thing that I would upgrade. I will put a link in the description for the car and some oil shocks as well. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a like and consider subscribing if you haven't already. Thank you for watching.